In this video, I will show you how you can connect your NoCodeDB in NITER. So go to your NoCodeDB instance. If you have cloud instance, you have to log in. If you have self host instance, you have to use your help host URL. So sign up for an account if you don't have an account. Once you log in, this is how your NoCodeDB dashboard looks like. And you have to go to this account settings right here. Once you go to account settings, click on API token. And if you don't have an API token, you have to add new token. Name the token, however you want. NITAN test token. And save it. So we got the test token. You can just copy the token and come to your NITAN. Let me create a new workflow and you can search for no code db whatever operation you can choose so in here we have to create new credential once you create it paste the api key you have copied and for the host url you have to use this url app.nocodb.com so if you local host you have to use that proper url uh, now my instance is on the cloud, so I'm going to use app.nocodb.com and save it. That's it. You know, now you can use whatever operation you want. Let me get, get a row. So sample views, row ID. Let me get many rows. Why do I need row ID? You know, return all. You see it's working, right? You can also do create rows, whatever operation. Let me try to create a row and get started. Sample views. If I go to get started sample views, I have these. So let me just try to create a row. So for creating a row, we have to define each column so for the first column it's album right album and the second column it's thumbnail if you want if you have binary field we can enable this and name the field thumbnail but right now i don't have binary file in the previous node so i'm just gonna skip that and go for platform And okay, I think let let me try this too. So for album, I'm gonna use direction and platform. Let me try Instagram. Okay, let me test this. Okay, it created. If I refresh this. You can see that row is added. If you want uh, this thumbnail, you can literally use, you know, just add a field, add thumbnail, enable the binary. You need to have binary file in the previous node. So let me try this one too. This time, I'll try some other name. Okay, that's not supposed to happen. Mm. I don't know if the spelling is right. Facebook. And take the input, which is data, which must be data from previous node. Let me test this. Okay, it ran successful. Let me refresh here.
you can see the file and the name the row has been added thank you for watching see you in the next video